Welcome back to a brand new video guys and as you can see I'm actually in the server called Oregon R Space today So yeah this server is packed with content and that's also the reason why I'll be starting a Iron Man series in here So yeah stay tuned for that And before the first episode starts I'll be also hosting a giveaway for a $20 in bonds and also for mystery boxes So how it's gonna go is I'll be doing two winners so one winner is gonna walk away with a $10 bond and a mystery box and also the second one will get himself a $10 bond and a mystery box and the first commenter will be walking away with juicy two mystery boxes so yeah definitely make sure to have this post notification turned on for that and if you want to be entered on today's giveaway you have to just like this video make sure to be subscribed to my channel and make sure to leave our Oregon icon down below and that way you'll be entered and yeah I'll be picking the winners every video and if you win, just hit me up on Discord. So yeah, guys, I hope you like this video. Peace out. All right, let's log in. I actually have the account ready. Oh yeah, that's the wrong one. This is the right one. So yeah, um, I already made myself the Iron Man account. As you can see, I have the Iron Man title t right there. So yeah, what do we get when we start? So we get the full Iron Man set. And if you have the normal account you get the full starter set a starter pet box as well what do we get a sheep dog does it give any stats as well um, I don't know so yeah also we get two mil cash so first things first let's figure out what we what we are gonna start with firstly let me actually showcase you the game modes you can also choose so here we log in um, let's just get a random appearance so yeah, you can either choose from the normal mode, the adventure mode, and here you have all the um, effects as well. Like the normal mode has 150 times combat XP, adventure mode has 25 times, the challenger has 20. I think this is one of the hardest has to be right, and the Iron Man actually has 100%. I mean 100 times. So yeah, this is what I chose. Yeah, this has to be the hardest, right? You only have one life. So yeah, when you have chosen what you wanna pick up. What mode? Let's do the challenge here for now. Confirm. Um, you also get yourself a option to choose a adventure path. Either you get yourself the brawler, the guardian, or the explorer. I chose the guardian on my account on my iron because this has everything. As you can see, it it has two percent luck. It has five percent increase when selling items to merchants and. 10% reduction of run energy so we will have basically unlimited energy run energy I hope so at least I think the brawler has 1 in 25% chance to double monster loot um, I don't know as a iron I don't really need double loot you know so I just need the one drop so that would be fine and the explorer is mostly for scaling and when you click on the confirm Oh yeah, let's do the Quadrant right now. Then you will be also teleported everywhere. And also, you get yourself the hourly, daily rewards as well when you log in. So definitely make sure to take advantage of that as well. And then you will be teleported all the way around. And you can see where everything is. Yeah, that's all it. So yeah, what I'll be starting with is actually the voting. Um, and then I will get some boat points and maybe I can even spend them on something I just voted, let's type in column column voted What do we get? So we get 5 mil cash Do we actually get that? Let's just... Yeah, we get 5 mil cash, 2 mystery boxes A supply crate and 2 supply crates as well, let's open up these What do we get? We don't need the seeds yet, I mean in the future for the farming we definitely need those and Mr. Boxes as well, what, to, what we can actually pull from here. I think the best things to go for, yeah, maybe the five dollar ones. Ancient Blessing, I think that gives me actually prayer bonus, you know. So this is useful item, yeah, 250k, it almost landed on the bond. Well, uh, kind of unlucky. So yeah, here you have your teleportation menu. For the PvP zone, you have a lot of places to teleport to. As you can see right there, for the bosses, they have a lot of bosses, like the Night Gazer, something I haven't seen before. 
Crystal Hanlef, Seren, haven't really seen this one either, Necromancer, Orgast, some cool custom bosses as well, and therefore the monsters, I'll be starting with, let's start with Chaos actually, and yeah, for the dungeons, you have all your Slayer Caves and everything, the skilling zones, and yeah, the mini games, Last Man Standing, Warrior Skilled, where was the mini game? And yeah, for the raids, they actually have four custom raids, as you can see right there. Usually, when you're playing your server, you have Chambers of Exeric, or like the Theater of Blood, but in the server, they have four custom raids, so something new. So yeah, let's teleport to Chaos and start from there. Also, I think I need to pick up my bones as well. Yeah, the XP is coming in pretty fast, so I like that. You know what, let me grab myself a slayer task, let's see how I can get there. Um, I need to find the slayer master, but yeah, what I'll be also doing is, when you start, make sure to actually start the, what's it called now, the adventurous path, yeah, exactly. You start from here, first thing I already completed is the wooding, then the second one is kill 10 giant rabbits near the FK zone. And you get yourself a rune skimmy. Oh yeah, can I actually use the stores now? Yeah, I totally forgot about that one. I don't think I can. Maybe I can, let's see. Right, I can use this door. Oh yeah, I cannot use that one. What about the agent VIP? This is for donator points. Vote store I can use, definitely. Master of Prestige. I don't need that one. Yeah, I cannot use the general store so I don't know where I'll be getting my armor but I will get the rune skimmy from what's it called now the adventurous path so the giant rabbits are right there as well so I need to kill 10 of these yeah Ooh, we got a strength enemy as well as the magic enemy oh yeah there was one as well but I didn't realize and we get our sellers first leg upgrade as well Sadly, I'm not wear them yet, but so yeah, let me actually train my defense then. And there's the helmet drop as well. I don't know what these monster tickets are meant for, but I'm just gonna pick them up. Maybe I'm gonna need them. I got two more to kill, but I'm still missing the plate buddy. I don't know if I can get it. Can I actually check the drop table as well, or I drop you where? So the chance of getting the... Oh, we can actually get the disc in me as well. You know what, let's just aim for that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get the plate body as well. I got all of these drops above. A DDS as well is what I can get. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna stay here for longer. Looks like they have two custom skill levels as well. Salvaging and Slaughter. That's sick. I don't know how you can train them yet, but we'll find that out soon. And that should be enough kills as well. Let's get the rewards, boom, you're gonna me. Gonna speed up the kills. Also, let's use the super combat potion right now. You know what, let's, I still need some more bones. Let's see, I'm gonna use these um, bones on the prayer altar. Hopefully that's gonna get me up to 21 level, yeah. I feel like I'm gonna get up to like 29 maybe, but not 31, 27, come on, let's, 29, yeah. Maybe that's gonna be enough. Now I'm missing like one bone. There's the 31 bear as well. I feel like I need to flick this. Since I don't wanna waste my fire potions. We got the rune skimmy but not the dragon one. That's kinda unfortunate. But you know what? Yeah. I should grab his light task as well. Maybe I get these. Then I can kill actually them on the task. So it looks like it's just typing Golden Golden Slayer. Trade. What rewards do we have in here? So yeah we have the full weight. Battle mage yet. I think it's the it's I think it's for mage. Sammy has the crystal bow. Also you can get like slayer helmet, enchantment scroll and so on. And these are the tools right there. We need this one. So yeah, let's get the task. Let's see what it's gonna be. Um obtain task. Confirm chicken, right. Let's just start with the chickens then. We can, when I get these giant rabbits as my task, then we can also kill them. They also have their unit plugins. So, 
that's also really awesome as you can see right there these chickens are like marked that's my CF task and there's the CF task completed that was also for the adventurous path right there yeah we get ourselves a slayer tome let's see what it's gonna do read all right it gives us some slayer xp and straight off the bat we are already 69 slayer and we also have the full inventory of bones so that's gonna most likely unlock the protection pairs as well yep there we have it the mage protection the range and also the melee and also we unlock the mystic might but that's for mage so wouldn't be uh, i mean i'm not gonna be using that so let's go back to Gorgon Slayer. Let's see how many points did we get. Trade. So we got 70 Slayer points. Alright. Let's grab a new task. So I had to change my Slayer Master as well. And we got 22 jellies. So I feel like that's gonna give me a lot of points. But I still wanna um, get the Dragon Skimmeter. Actually, let me check something. Let me check my Adventure Path. What's the next task actually? Reach 50 level in any skill. We get a lamp. What should I use this on? Complete the run of cold rush. So how you do it is you click on the activities option right there. How does it work? Then it tells you how to do it. Let's just go to I would like to play based on your current APR. Alright. You will get I don't know like how the key points or whatever it is. So I have five minutes. Um, I think I should grab some food as well Yeah, that's what I should do honestly. Yeah, I Think I need a better weapon as well and that so I'm gonna skip this one and I'll do it in the future when I have Like void and shit. Yeah, never mind. I ran all the way to the dust devils and then I was like where they are at and looks like they are actually at the Fremen Slayer dungeon yeah, this, this is the right place. Yep, found them. Hopefully they shouldn't be that hard to kill as well. Um, I should have grabbed my prayer potion, but it is what it is. What do they drop though? Is there something we can actually get a steel axe? I guess that's kind of useful. Some gems as well. Um, cold bar, some rions, meteor boots. Right, this is something that I would actually need. Definitely gonna be picking up major bars as well. A tooth half of key as well. So I just need the loop, right? And then I could actually get a crystal key. Alright, last kill. This task took me like... I'm not even gonna lie, like... 25 minutes at least. Boom. How many points did we get? Right, 70 points, yeah. Um, We got some supplies, I'll take that, as you can see. For the crafting. Do I pick these up? Actually the room kite, I need that one. Yeah, let's pick that up. I look like a player right now. But, <laughs> I mean, it is what it is. Alright, I'm gonna go back to the giant rabbits for now. Oh, we got the DDS. I mean, I need the D scheme, come on now. If I can get the DDS, I can get the D scheme as well, definitely, right? And we got the plate body as well. Come on, like back to back go drops. In other DDS, that was like back to back to back drops. No way, no way, no way, no way. We got the D-Skim as well. That was like four drops back to back to back to back to back. That's insane, I have never had this kind of luck before. So yeah, that's it for me today. So yeah, that's it. I'll be wrapping up the first RMN episode in Oregon RSPS right here. So yeah, we got some nice gear upgrades. Um... We are definitely next episode going for the void set. Just need to complete a couple more slayer tasks. And yeah, finally we got the D scheme as well after like I don't know how many kills I did, but yeah, that was pretty lucky when I got the drop. Before that I had two DDS drops. And yeah, the body drop as well. So yeah, that was kinda weird. So yeah, um and yeah that's how the stats are looking like. Definitely gonna turn up my mage and something else as well i wanna unlock already the you know the abyssal demons if i can then maybe get the beep as well from there so yeah uh, make sure to enter the bond as well i'll be doing two winners as i said and yeah guys 
I'll see you in the next episode. Peace out.